Hey everybody, it's Amy from Magic and Light Collection. You can find all of our products at www.magicandlightcollection.com. I've been working with the Portrait Magic Action Set today, which is a new action set that we released last week. Um, I just did a series of videos for our video library that showed you how to um, do a lot of stuff um, with the skin prep, the beauty enhancers, and, that, and also the finishing touches. Um, right now I want to show you how to use the Quick Clean Action to uh, help your image out a little bit. Now this image um, is pretty dull. Um, we need to go ahead and make it pop a little bit. We need to do a little work with the skin and then we'll, uh, in another video, we will uh, work with the eyes. So let's get started. First I'm going to select the Quick Clean Action, which is a bonus action that I included with the Portrait Magic set. We're going to press play. Now you can see it runs all over the whole image. Um, some of these layers we don't need, some of them we do need, some things we need to brush on, some things we need to brush off. So um, the first thing is the contrast. I don't think we need this layer, um, so I'm going to go ahead and delete it. But if we uh, wanted to just have a little less contrast, we could use the master opacity slider to take the contrast down or bring the contrast up. We can also brush off some of the contrast selectively by using the layer mask. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and delete it because I don't feel like we need it for this image. Uh, color boost, we definitely need. This gives it a nice boost of color. Um, and again, we can selectively brush off the areas where we don't need it. Um, optional slight lighten. This uh, is turned off because not all images need it. If you'd like to use this layer, then you can just uh, click on the uh, layer visibility right here in the eye. Obviously, we don't need this image to be lightened any more than it is. So we're going to leave it off and I'm going to delete it. Now we definitely do need the richness brush here so I'm going to select the layer mask. Um, you can see this um, effect is hidden right now and we want to go ahead and reveal it so we're going to brush on the layer mask. Since it's black we're going to use a white brush, select our brush tool, make sure white is the foreground color and I have the opacity of the brush set to 100%. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and brush on the image wherever it needs a little bit of extra richness, which kind of is all over the image. We're going to go ahead and not brush on the skin. Just hit the shirt here. Go in a little bit to get the hair that I might have missed. Now the goal in all of this is to just make it look like a better version of her um, and not totally different. We want it to look as natural as possible. Just make sure I've got all this. Okay, let's look at before and after the richness brush. Before and after, that's a huge difference. I think that looks great. The color boost, um, it's a question on her face whether or not we need it. I think for now, we'll go ahead and leave it. So I'm gonna go ahead and flatten this so that I can work with the next, um, the next action. Okay, that's how you use the Quick Clean Action from the Portrait Magic Action Set. You can find all of our products on the, online at www.magicandlightcollection.com.